Hey guys, so I uh, asked on my Instagram account uh, to ask me questions about anything related to texturing or lighting, whatever about in Blender or Cinema 4D. And the first question I, I got was just lightning in Blender. <laughs> it really made me giggle and uh, well, let's see what I can come up with. All right, I'll show you how I would do lightning in Blender. Here we go. This is the wall. Uh, let's make um, just a plane. This will be the base for the lightning. Well, you know, I'm not really that great at modeling, I have to admit, but I'll do my best. Uh, what, what does the lightning look like, actually? I have no idea. I should probably use some reference. Um, let's see. Uh, I'm extruding. Just extruding some edges of this uh, <laughs> slightly misshapen plane. Hmm, how is this going to turn into lightning? Uh, that is a really good question. So, hmm. Hey, it's starting to look like some kind of lightning. All right, I'm going to use X. No, uh, let's see. Where's the merge function? Uh, merge vertices. There it is. At center. And let's now give this some thickness using the uh, solidify modifier. More thickness. And let's move this somewhere in front of the wall. A little bigger. And give it a nice material. Well, let's call this lightning. Of course, this is going to need an emission shader. How about we make it pink? I love pink. Let's go to the rendered view. And I've already got... Oh no, I don't have cycles yet, so I'm just going to turn on cycles. And make the wall look a bit more interesting. This is the wall. Maybe make it a little darker. You know, let's make it blue. Pink and blue, yeah, why not? And give this more strength. More emission strength. More emission strength. Hmm. Let's link the camera to the viewport. Zoom in a little. Unlink it again. So where do I want to go with this? I think I want to add some additional glow. So let me show you how I would add some additional glow. Because you know, Eevee comes with a really cool uh, bloom uh, effect. But Cycles doesn't have that. I'll show you how to add it using the uh, compositing editor. So you go to compositing. Turn on use notes. Uh, move these apart. Shift A and then look for glare. My favorite compositor note. The glare notes. Now I have to render this once again. Right, actually I forgot to just add a uh, viewer note using control shift and clicking on this glare note. Now I've got my viewer note. Using the alt key I can uh, move it around. And now I can play with this uh, glare effect and I don't like the streaks. They are more for sparkly little highlights, um, like on jewelry, jewelry for example. I, uh, in this case, the fog glow works better. So let's play around with this. The threshold is good, I think. We can make it a little bigger. We can turn up the quality. And let's see what this looks like. And there we go. Now you know how to make lightning in Blender using a glow effect. By the way, do not take this too seriously. I was just having a little bit of fun. Um, I promise you I'll be making some more useful quick tips soon. Bye bye.